Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Okay, the wait is finally over. Trip number two of the summer, New York! Woo! Guys, I freaking love New York so much. I've only been there once and it was awesome, so I'm so excited to go again. I haven't been there in like three years, so I literally need a new york trip but i'm so excited if you guys didn't know i do have an older sister and she does live in new york but we are super close and i love her so much so any opportunity for me to see her is just so awesome but yeah so i'm so excited there's not really a specific reason that we are going to new york however my grandma is going to be performing there but that's like an additional thing it's not like the main reason why we're going we're just trying to make as many trips as possible and i haven't seen my sister in a while so it's gonna be awesome but with that being said this video is going to be a pack with me for this trip guys i leave tomorrow for new york and i have nothing packed like it's really bad like can you see my suitcase it's freaking empty and i just like i need a like speed pack i have nothing packed so you guys need to help me on this one but literally i haven't started packing at all so this video is going to be a little bit chaotic i apologize in advance so without further ado i hope you all enjoyed this video and let's get packing Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna pack are t-shirts. But first I'm just gonna gather up some of the t-shirts I have in mind that I want to bring and then we'll pack them. Okay, here we are. I don't even know how many I got. I just threw a bunch of t-shirts that I like and then I'm just gonna pack them. Also, the trip is a total of 11 days. So basically two weeks. So it's a long trip. I'm gonna need a lot of clothes. So here's the first t-shirt I'm going to be bringing. It's this white and gray t-shirt and then it has like dragons. It has red, white, blue, a whole bunch of colors. I think it's supposed to be like mimicking Japan or China, but it's super cute. This has always been one of my favorite t-shirts and I just don't see myself going anywhere without it. Next, we have the one and only New York shirt for New York. It says New York Central Park and it's hot pink, super cute. Then we have this tie-dye crop top. I hardly wear crop tops, but obviously I'm going to wear a jacket over it because a thing to know about me is I don't really like to show skin when I'm wearing clothes. Next, we have this white, blue, and pink t-shirt. This has always been the simplest shirt I have, but also so cute. I don't mind simple, as long as it's cute, it can work. Next, we have a Bob Marley t-shirt. This is a rega t-shirt. It has Bob Marley on the front and then a picture of him on the back. Obviously, I need my Jamaican shirts because I'm Jamaican, <laughs> if you haven't noticed already. Also, I forgot to show you this in the shirt, but I cut the neck long and literally, I'm so happy I did that because it turned out so well. But then we have this yellow flex t-shirt with a pink bunny and a pink hat. I don't even have to explain this t-shirt. You can already see how it's so cute. Then we have this dark blue t-shirt that says LA. Also one of my favorites. And this with like a gold necklace, gold earrings, chef's kiss. Then we have just another simple tee. It says brick and lace told us love is wicked, but we were too busy dancing. Once again, this is my mom's merch. I've said this in like a lot of my videos, but my mom's merch is fire. Go cop it. I love this shirt. Then we have another shirt of my mom's merch. It says love is wicked with a heart. Also, it has a stand on it. I'm gonna get that out, don't worry. So I'm not gonna fold it just yet, but I just wanted to show you guys so you know that I'm bringing it. Then we have this pink and blue t-shirt, super simple. And just for funsies, I'm going to bring this pink crop top. Once again, I'm going to wear a white tank top under it, so don't worry. And also this white and red crop top. Okay, and that's it for shirts. I just counted, I have 11 shirts in total, so that sounds about perfect for what I'm going to wear in New York. So yeah, that's it for t-shirts. Okay, the next category of this video is going to be dresses and sweaters. In total, I have three dresses and three sweaters. Here's the first dress. I think this would be super cute for like a dinner or like a party. I don't know, it's just very flowery and very, you know, fancy dinner -y vibes. Next dress, we have this flower dress. This isn't necessarily for like a dinner. Maybe I'll just wear this casually if we're going to like explore a place because it is comfortable, it's stretchy, so I can definitely move in it, but I still think it's super cute. So yeah, this is awesome. <laughs> then the last dress is more formal. This one would also be for like a dinner, but I just think it's super cute overall. Then for sweaters, we have the iconic New York sweater, specifically for New York. It is this black and white comfy jacket. It's not necessarily a sweater, but it goes under that category, if you know what I mean. 
Then we have this Rick and Morty colorful rainbow sweater. It's a cropped sweater, by the way, and it's super cute. And then my favorite sweater of all, my Hollywood hot pink sweater. Okay, so now I have to put all the dresses and sweaters into my suitcase. Moving on to the next category, we have shorts. I did go shopping and buy some new things, so you guys are going to be seeing some new clothes for this category. First off, we have these jean shorts. These are my everyday jean shorts, my favorite. I've had them for like a while now, so I love these. Also, jean shorts go with everything, so if you're not bringing like a pair of jean shorts on a trip, what are you doing? Then we have white and pink shorts. Super comfortable and could go with a really cute, nice pink t-shirt. Awesome. Then I have my favorite red shorts. These just go with everything I wear. Then I recently bought these new shorts from Charlotte Russe. I love these so much. Shop at Charlotte Russe. Then I got these new sweatpants. I love these so, so much. Gray and white go with everything. These are fire. I don't know what to say. Also, they're not hot. They're very cool, actually. And then I recently just bought these new jeans from Air Apostle. I don't like jeans that have like two big rips that it's like, what are you doing so this is just the perfect size for me then lastly for this category i have these simple black leggings because come on you have to bring simple black pants to every trip also i forgot to mention these black and white dragon shorts and i'm not mad about how they came out they're actually super cute with that being said that is all for shorts now let's move on to swimwear okay guys so for swimwear i'm going to bring two bathing suits in total now, if you guys are thinking, why only bringing two? New York is originally cold, so summer can't make it that hot. And obviously we are going to be going to the pool once or twice, but not like every, every day. Obviously I love the pool and I'll go swimming anywhere, like literally anywhere. So I'm only bringing two, please don't hate on me for this. But here's the first one. I have this hot pink bathing suit with hot pink bottoms to match. And I don't know why, I just found this super cute. It also comes with like a pink skirt. But then I have this green and white tropical t-shirt. I mean, not t-shirt. So yeah, these are the two bathing suits I'm going to be bringing. Okay guys, so as you just saw, I just packed all my pajamas and my undergarments. So the last thing I have to pack are all my essentials. And that's going in my special tote bag. So I'm just going to quickly show you guys all the essentials I'm going to be bringing. Eco gel, obviously. Pineapple perfume. Deodorant. Hairbrush and edge brush. Toothbrush, my favorite bomb gloss, Rebecca Minkoff perfume, a scarf to hold my hair down, a bunch of hair ties, obviously, lotion. Okay, and that's it. I think I got everything. But yeah, that seems about it. I showed you guys everything. Shoes will be in my New York vlog, so make sure you go watch that vlog, please. Because, like, what's the point of watching the pack with me without watching the actual vlog? Like, you need to see the outfits on me. But that is it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed so, so much. I definitely did. This is the quickest I've ever packed in my life, considering that I only have a night to pack because we're leaving tomorrow morning. But, yeah. Make sure you guys watch the New York vlog, please. I hope you guys enjoyed once again. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one. Peace!